In China, they're waging war on the weather. A drought so severe, they're firing rockets into the sky to make it rain. The practice is known as cloud seeding. Drones and rockets are used to sow silver iodide into the clouds. The substance has a similar structure to ice and changes the cloud's structure to increase the chance of rain. After more than two months of extreme heat, it is desperately needed. Right now we are rather sufficient in our artificial influence rocket supply. We have strengthened monitoring of the weather and carried out artificial precipitation operations accordingly to further relieve the drought and high temperature in the area. The drought is the worst China's seen since records began 60 years ago, decimating farmland along the basin of the Yangtze. Normally one of China's main arteries, it supports nearly half a billion people and a third of the country's crops. This was Poyang Lake in the central Jiangxi province 12 months ago. High water and lush vegetation throughout. But what a difference a year makes. A flood outlet reduced to a trickle and what was green turned to brown. Teams of officials have been dispatched to the stricken areas, diverting rivers for irrigation and scouring the mountains for whatever sources remain to pump water to the villages where supplies are drying up. Every day we trek for some 12 kilometers to inspect at least four villages where we check for possible blockage in water channels or leaks throughout the water pipes. In some provinces, factories have shut down and cities have imposed blackouts after reservoirs used to run hydroelectric power stations ran low. And as the heat wave begins to subside, attentions now turn to assessing the damage. Ivor Bennett, Sky News.